Hi everyone, it's Tiffany. I'm back in Disney Dreamlight Valley, A Rift in Time. Today we're going to pick up with the search for guests on the heroes, treasures in each biome based on the memory. So we're still looking for the one in Ancient's Landing and the Glittering Dunes. Now I'm convinced, oops, where did I go? Sorry. I'm convinced that it's not in the plains or the oasis or Gaston's little shelter thing down here. I, we haven't checked the wastes yet, which could be a contender. Also, the borderlands could be, we haven't gotten that far though. Like we don't have that unlocked yet, but maybe in this episode, <laughs> that'd be actually pretty awesome. We'll see. And then Ancients Landing, what I'm going to do, we're up here. I'm going to start over here and we're going to make our way up and go all the way to the secret beach, right? So wherever it may be, we're gonna start over on the island where Eve's house, or Eve was found originally. And then we'll, we'll go from there. We'll see how it goes. All right. And then I'll also keep an eye out for it. Um, should I get my shovel in hand? Oh, that's not my shovel. All right, we're gonna start, I guess, in like this corner over here. And we'll just kind of, search and patches here whoops oh there it is that's it that's it yes it's a light bulb okay that was okay that was easy <laughs> i hope the other ones is easy if if it's in the waste i will be very happy if it if it's not there i'm not sure where else we should search <laughs> i i feel pretty confident it's either in the waste or the borderlands though part of me thinks it's in the borderlands but we shall see. I kind of want to start on the other end of the waist, but we can start here, I guess. All right, let's look. Uh, oh, is this it? There's a dig spot. Is that it? That wasn't it. What was that? Wait. A meat pie recipe. Okay. That wasn't it, but it was something. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's keep looking. Hmm. I'm gonna kind of do it in patches. So we'll look over here. Okay. I'm not seeing anything. Could be like back behind these areas too. Uh, let's, let's, let's just, oh, I clicked off of the game. Goodness. All right. Um, oh, there's a blue chest over there. Should I just jump ahead and get that really quickly? <laughs> it's fine. Oh, ah, thank you, blue chest. You led me right to it. All right. Let's go ahead and open our chest, and then I'll show these treasures to Gaston. There you go, Gaston. Is this what you were looking for, sir? A light bulb, a rope, and a brush? What? These aren't treasures. They're just junk. Still, I did work hard to find them. That's got to count for something. Gaston, we talked about this. Don't you know by now that I'm a man of action, not talk? At least now we can track down who they belong to. Ah. Me? No. Remember what I told you about appearing like a hero? Ah. Oh, right. I suppose we can return them then. We've got a brush, a light bulb, and a climbing pick. Let's take a closer look. I wonder if the climbing pick's are Rapunzel's. In the... I don't know. Uh, someone with a... Oh, someone with a taste for adventure owned that one. Definitely. We've got a brush, a light bulb, and a climbing pick. The light bulb, I've never seen such an item before. They make light. They can be used for all sorts of things like bright decorations, grow lights for plants, and so much more. <sighs> so Eve. Sounds like something Belle's father would make. We've got a brush, a light bulb, uh -huh. the brush. There are some very long hairs in here. But they're all bleached after being in the desert so long. No way to tell who they belong to from the color. Let's go talk to different villagers and see if we can figure out the rightful owners. I made notes in case your memory isn't as razor sharp as mine. Thank you, Gaston. Thank you. Uh, onwards. I'll keep the items with me for now so I can return them myself and receive my rightful praise. Of course you will. <laughs> okay, so I need to find the owners. I don't... No, okay, yeah, Eve is definitely one. Woody and, oh gosh, there's a lot of friends. Okay, let's start with Eve. She's here, right here. Hey, Eve. Directive. Hello, Eve. Did you happen to lose a light bulb? Oh, you seem pretty happy. I'm going to take that as a yes. Hey, Wally. Yes, it was a gift from Wally. Wally. Well, I'm happy that it will be returned to you. Gaston will bring it over right away. Okay. And then we have the pick and the brush. I'm not sure. Ooh, maybe 
Who do we have? Who do we have? Um, the pick is Kristoff's for sure. It's gotta be. It has to be. Okay. Hello. Oh, hey. Hey, Kristoff. Uh, Gaston and I are looking for the owner of a climbing pick. Have you lost any lately? Nope. Can't say I have. Oh, well, I thought this would be yours for sure. I was, it was a little small for you though. I'll keep looking. Good luck in your search. Hmm. See ya. Definitely thought that would be. Who else do we have? I mean, there's Mother Gothel, there's Scrooge McDuck. Guess let's go talk to both of them since they're in the same area. Hey. Hey, Scrooge McDuck. Cause maybe, maybe the pick belongs to Mother Gothel for like climbing, you know? I always have a moment for you, Tiffany. Mm. What can I help you with? Gaston and I are trying to track down the owner of a climbing pick. Could it be yours? Hey. Leap in Loch Ness, I'm sure it is. I thought I'd lost it forever on an exploration back in my adventuring days. Might be a little time worn now, but still in great condition. Gaston will bring it to you. Thank you kindly. <laughs> it's almost mixed up for getting me to invest in business with no revenue. <laughs> well, happy to help. I'll let you discuss the whole investment situation with Gaston. Thank Interesting. You, I would have never guessed he had a climbing pick. Uh, who else do we have? We have Rapunzel and we have Maui. Is that everybody? Oh, Merlin too. Who would have a hairbrush? I feel like... What if it's like bleached? And they don't know if it's like... Okay, we're gonna start... I have a, I have a hunch it's either Rapunzel or Merlin. Because they said they can't tell the color of the hair. So maybe, maybe it wasn't like bleached by the desert sun or whatever, but it in fact was like gray hair from Merlin. <laughs> Merlin, Gaston and I found a brush in the desert. Could it belong to you? You know, it just might. I completely forgotten about my beard brush. Great, I'll get Gaston to bring it back to you. Mickey gave that to me as a gift long before the forgetting. And well, my beard has been rather out of sorts. Be glad to brush it thoroughly. Uh -oh. Thank you, Tiffany. You're welcome. All right, that was easier than I thought. All right, where is Gaston? He was following me a second ago. Here he comes. One second, we just gotta wait for him to show up. Any day now. There we go. Hey, bud. Um, there we go. Gaston, the rightful owners of all the items have been determined. <laughs> Excellent, I'll return them so they can all thank me. Yeah, yeah. So, how did that feel? It was pleasant, though no one was grateful enough to give us a proper re reward. Doing good is its own reward. You sound like someone who's gotten used to not being rewarded. Still, I can tell that you did your best to entertain me today. It's important to reward a sidekick when they're at least attempting to do well. Mm, if you put up fishing trophies in your house as well, you can imagine you're me. So here, have this. Oh, thank you, I guess. <laughs> thank you? They're actually kind of cool. Thanks, Gaston. <laughs> you may not be the best sidekick, but you did help me discover the benefit of being a hero. I'm not your sidekick. Not with that attitude you aren't. <gasps> Run along for now. I'll be in touch if I need you again. Thank you, Gaston. Um, I think we need to get level seven for Gaston's next quest. So we are still looking for the three flowers for Mickey. We do have some of them. I just have put them in my inventory, so I don't have them right now. I know I saw some orange uh, birds of paradise in the courtyard very recently. So I'm going to grab those. Hopefully Gaston's still following me. I think he's still hanging out with me. I'm not entirely sure though. Um, what else do we gotta do? We have other quests. Oh, the borderlands, should we do that? I feel like we should. I did just unlock the promenade though. Mm -hmm. I'm torn. I'm torn. I am... Oh. Let's get that. Okay, we got a double mist. So, the Borderlands was like 10,000 mist. Do I have enough? Where am I even going? Oh, we're so close. <laughs> oh my gosh. Alright. Well, being that we're so close to achieving the uh, Borderlands unlock, let's... Oh, that was... Oh, that's a new thing. We haven't gotten that before. Let's see about, like, what we can find here. I guess that's that's not mist. I feel like now that I need mist, it's not gonna come... Oh, 200. I think that might have pushed us over. Let me see. One second, we're frozen. Okay, let me go back here. Yeah, we're at 10,000 now, so that's a sign. Let's just go do that. I'm gonna recap the quest, though, for us. So we are still looking for some items for Rapunzel's Tower. 
still have to get the black and white capybara and red and white striped capybara for Mirabelle, but they're not here today. <laughs> um, flower power for Mickey. That'll be an easy one. I think I probably, I probably have most of them. The green fly drop I might need to find more of. And then this one with Merlin, which I got to upgrade all of our like pickaxe and shovels and everything. Now they cost, um, those ancient cores and I still haven't found more. I found one, but that's it. And it's been days. It's, I search every day and it's just like, I cannot find them. So this is what I'm looking forward to right now. Unlock the borderlands and the glittering dunes to re reach the palace. Search for mist with your hourglass. So let's just go do that. I'm, I'm ready. I'm ready to go do that. So we are, let's take the transport to the plains because that's the closest transport to the borderlands. And then we will go unlock this place. I mean, we can unlock the borderlands from the wild tangle as well, but we're gonna just go into doing this. Now, hopefully a lot of fun stuff will come of this. I'm gonna grab uh, some of these sands though, so I can, actually, I went up to the waste. I shouldn't have done that. Oh, no, 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 I can get there. That's, I can unlock it right there. Is this the like only place I can access it from? I mean, I can from right here in the plains. I guess I should have did that. Maybe I'll do that so I don't have to come in on the side. Silly me. Not paying attention to where I'm going. Okay, here we go, guys. This is it. I'm very excited. Also, like half of these guys, I don't really... No offense, but I don't want them here. Like, they can go back home. I think they're just here temporarily for the quest, so they'll, they'll leave. All right, 10,000. We're gonna about to have the whole map unlocked, which is insane. All right, here we go. This is gonna be all my miss, though, for right now. We need to get some more. We're at 300. Hey, at least it's not zero. All right. Interact with the time anom anomaly in front of the door of Jafar's palace. So we don't need to do that right this second. I feel like that might be a whole episode within itself, but maybe not. Maybe, maybe not. I'm going to just work on exploring for right now and we're going to clear and kind of just figure things out. Now, I obviously don't have my tools fully upgraded, so we can't do like the bigger rocks and stuff yet. All right. I'm going to gather this memory here. I believe we're already here near Jafar's palace. There's some aloe there. I'm kind of keeping some of the stuff here because I just know I won't have inventory space for it in a little bit. So definitely want to... Oh, there's a transport. Oh, yes. Okay, I got to get that. There's also um, there so many nice people here. lots of trees that I'm going to have to pull over to the orchard, which I still haven't really worked on in a while. But that's okay. We will get there. Hi, Kristoff. All right, let's get all of this done and then we will definitely unlock that transport. Oh, I'm gonna, oh, it's gonna be so exciting. Okay, I do need to like reorganize the transports so that I can get like everything where I need it to be in the best, like most central locations, you know? All right, we found a lot of fun stuff. We've got a lot of mist too. We already are back up to a thousand. I'm gonna buy this transport though. Good day, Thank you. It's going to be 10,000 coins. Not bad at all. I'll take it for some easy, fast transport, of course. Hey, there it is. And now, I'm also wondering if there's a way down there. Because remember, we still couldn't figure out how to get down there. I wonder if there's a way. Where are we at? So we're about here. Oh, there is. There's like a little path, right? Is that accurate? I knew that looked interesting. This must be it. Can I not, like, move? I can't go down there. I don't know if this is a situation where I can actually move it, because, like, the last time I was trying to move the furniture, yeah, I can't move those. Okay, well, we'll figure it out in time. Oh, there's a note. We want to get that note for sure. Let's go ahead and check that, and I'm gonna, I think it'll be Gaston's little book thing. Let's see. What does it say? There's something nice about being alone. Nobody to Eating too many eggs, leave the books, bookseller alone. Hmm. All right, and then we'll go over here. Okay. And then I definitely want to move those trees. They're going to be quite, quite the trek to move those, though. Right, let's just do that really quickly. Now that I'm thinking of it, I think there's three total. All right, one, and up oh, this one here, two, three. And then I think... Oh gosh, I'm gonna take him down here to the courtyard area for right this second. 
and then I'll go this way. And then this is where I can move them. Oh, right here. All right, I'm gonna, oh, there we go. And here, I'm gonna just throw them in here. Honestly, they don't have an order right now. I need to fix up that place anyway. All right, so that's all of the trees from that section. Good job, everyone. And we have this upper section, which connects to the wastes and it connects to the wild tangle. This also connects to the wild tangle right there. I don't remember seeing that. I kind of want to just go back and take a look. See, okay. Cause there's rocks there. Um, let me kind of clear this a little bit because I, I wonder if there's any kind of like treasures or anything down there. Hold on. Let's see. Nothing there. Cause I was thinking there might be like pages or something. Nope. That's okay. Let's go back. And then, hold on. I can't, I'm getting, trying to get around these things. Okay. Got those. Oh, there's another page right there. Almost missed that one. There also might be something back there, but we have all those things in the way. I guess I need to upgrade one of my tools for that. Exploring jungle yesterday. Flash of blonde hair. Is someone out here? Just my imagination. I hope I haven't developed one. All right, let's keep going, Gaston. You're silly. We're going up to this next level to see what we can discover. All right, let me get my hourglass out. Looks like there's quite a lot of sands here. So this is where it connects to the wastes. Uh, I don't think there's anything there. So then we come back over here. We've got lots of shards. We've got lots of sands. So let's... Oop. Let's get these all cleared out before we head up there. I don't even know if we'll head up there in this episode because I feel like Jafar's quests and stuff really do take some time, you know? So we'll need to really be prepared. But it might not take time at all. I think I might wait till the next episode, though, for real. Just because, I mean, we're already more than halfway through this episode and we have more clearing to do and we can, we can look for more stuff for things. Anyway, let's keep going. We're just moving forward and we're seeing what happened. I mean, I could just wing it too. Never say this aloud, but can write it down. I miss Le Fu. It is nice when he tells me that I'm the best. Aww. Uh, let me get my sand thing back out. And here. Okay. Another one. And another one. Nope, another one. And then we've got lots of these guys here. Let's get all of them. And here's another. And then we have one cacto berry. I think that's cacto berry plant that we need to take back with us. All right. And then there's just this one last one. And then this should connect to the uh, promenade section. Is it the promenade? I think so. Yes. Perfect. All right. I'm going to put the cacto berry back. Nope, that's not what I want to do. And we're going to go up to... Oh, there's a page there, too, I need to get. But we'll go up to where Jafar is. We might not talk to him just yet, but we'll we'll, we'll see how close we can get. All right, let's get this page. And it should be Gaston journal entry once again. What's it say? What's it say? Hail King Gaston of Gastonia, everything perfect here, especially with Le Fou. Should I make him my squire or perhaps a duke? Hmm. How many do we have of his? I know we have two more to find of Rapunzel's. Okay, we have like four more to find of his. All right, we'll go up here. Here we go. This is like the last level. And... Can we get through here? Oh, okay. Okay, okay. Oh, what's happening? Oh, there he is. Oh. Hello. At last, we meet in the flesh. Uh, I, hi. You buy uh, no sudden moves. Oh, please. After all the time we have worked together, do you not trust me? Pity. I was hoping you could help me with one more task. What is it? There is something hidden deep beneath this island. A relic of untold power. It's called the Spark of Imagination. 
What is it? I have only read the legends, but it is said to be the first spark of inspiration that drove the creation of this world. You mean, it's the magic behind all of Dreamlight Valley. And Eternity Isle. Dreamlight magic may very well spring from this one ancient relic. <sighs> Let me guess, you want me to get this spark of imagination for you. Very astute, Tiffany. Only someone wielding the hourglass can reach it. I fear the path is lost to time. After the way you proved yourself in the Cave of Wonders, I have convinced you, I have convinced you will manage to find your way without making an utter fool of yourself. Why, you even managed to get through all of my puzzles without asking for a single hint. This Most is a really impressive. Amazing place. What exactly do you want the spark of imagination for? Why must you ask so many questions? I'm not risking my neck again without an explanation. Ugh, if you must know, with the spark of imagination, all of space and time would blend to my desire. At last, I could make the world the way I ought to be, it ought to be, and have my revenge on Aladdin. Of course, there will always be a place for you, my humble servant at my side. Okay, now I'm definitely not helping you. Then I suppose I'll have to do everything myself. Give me that hourglass. It is rightfully mine. What? Did he just take my hourglass? No, he didn't. Oh. Oh, okay, I got my team. My team of besties. Okay, what's happening? I think he literally took it, and, like, what am I supposed to do now? <laughs> oh, man. Okay. No, I still have it. Jafar has vanished, but you get the feeling he'll be back. Talk to Merlin. All right, let's go. Let's go talk to Merlin. Let's see about that. Um, but since I am here by the castle, I want to take a little picture. A cute little picture. It's like so cute. Love it. Look at that. Me in the castle. <laughs> um, I kind of want to get like a scared face though. Like, oh no, not not that. Like a like a like a nervous. <laughs> uh oh, face. Okay, and then uh, we gotta go find Merlin. Okay, I actually, can I go through here? That's my question, because I would like, read? The door to the palace is barred from the other side. It seems Jafar has retreated inside. Okay, so over here. This is where I, in the last episode from the promenade, I was like, oh, <gasps> it's an ancient core. Oh, how nice. I wish there were like five in there. Jeez, I need so many of <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're gonna go back. We're gonna find Merlin. We're gonna talk to him. Where is he? He's over here in the lagoon-ish area. Definitely want to see what's up, what he thinks. And uh, which way do we need to go? Over here-ish? Somewhere? Yep, there he is. Hey, Merlin, uh, kind of need your help. We have a problem. Tiffany, I see you've so managed to mend the rift in time around the palace. Hmm, I suppose that means Jafar's free. Not quite. I... it was all part of a bigger what scheme. Well, thunder? that's no surprise. Tell me what sort of scheme. Jafar tried to take the hourglass from me, but Rapunzel, Gaston, and Eve didn't like that. Eve almost gave Jafar a taste of her laser cannon. Jafar vanished. I can only guess he's hiding in the palace. It's kind of his fortress. But before that... He said he's after something called the spark of but imagination. I, I the spark of imagination? Why, I've never heard of it. Jafar said that it was somewhere beneath this island and only someone with the hourglass can find it. Oh, and he also said that it would give him the power to control all of space but and time. Control all of space and time? Then we've no choice but to stop Listen him. Closely. Whoever this spark of imagination is, or yes. whatever it is, we it's must find terrible. it before Jafar does. But where do we start? Where so many good adventures start with a trip to the library. I must do some research. This may take quite a while. In the meantime, keep uncovering the secrets of Eternity Isle and do whatever you can to make it feel like home. Now then, I wonder if the spark of imagination might be connected to the realm of magic of the realms. You ought to try venturing to one of the realms and using your hourglass to search there. Why, there's no telling what you might find or what you could create from it. Okay. So, in conclusion. All right, we've got a new quest. So we got the Jafar one's gone. And we got this new one. Scrooge McDuck has more tips for you on the economy of Eternity Isle. Let's go talk to him because I hate leaving the ones where I just need to talk to them open-ended, you know? Because then if I need to talk to them for something else for another reason, then I have to accept the quest and then it's like, I gotta remember to do this. So we'll just go ahead and accept it and see what's up. Okay, he's over down here. 
Hi, Scrooge McDuck. I'm actually surprised he hasn't been in his shop all day. <laughs> Hey, Greetings, Tiffany, I made another discovery. You got time for another tip rent about um, aut automation? The automate in the island? Let's hear it. You must remember how I was telling you this island used to be home to all sorts of ancient machines that help care for it. I managed to learn more about one. It's some sort of machine that gardens for you. <gasps> yes. <laughs> Aye, it's quite remarkable. Reminds me of the sort of thing my dear friend Gyro builds. There's one wee problem. I don't know where you're gonna find all the ancient parts to build it. Ancient parts, that's the sort of thing I'm always finding with my hourglass. Will, why don't you take these ancient blueprints and see what you can do with them? It looks like I should have no problem finding all of the stuff and building an ancient gardener. I'll get to work. Aye, and if it's not gardening and you're interested in it, you can always make another kind of ancient <laughs> machine. The potential here is grand. I cannot wait to see what you do. Thank okay. You kindly. Oh. Let's see, uh, build any ancient machine at the time bending table. Did he not like give me blueprints? Like that just was, a, I mean, like I already did that, right? I already made the ancient cooker. But I do want to see about the ancient gardener. I don't have many of the ancient cores and I really do need to upgrade my tools, but I'm tired of it. You know, I really want a gardener. All right, ancient machine. So I can do the regular and advanced. Interesting, because I have the basic, right? And then there's, so it's basic, regular, and advanced. Uh, I need ancient core level two for those. And level three for the, ooh, uh, no. Gross. Yeah, I only have one ancient core. But I know I have the other ones. Uh, well, there is a basic gardener, right? I don't know the base difference between the basics and the regulars and the advanced. So I kind of want to figure out what that is, I'll just do some research on my own. Uh, and then I think, well, how much is the hourglass upgrade? 10K, we definitely want to do that. Look at that, that's cute. I like a lot of these, they're so cute. Pickaxe potion and stuff. Hmm. Well, anyway, let's see. I want to also explore, well, those are the only things we can make, the ancient machines. Uh, what about the upgrades here? This is what we want to look for next. So mist is kind of what we're missing for these. So I'll just have to find more mist and hopefully be able to level up my plants. My plants? Did I just say my plants? <laughs> level up my tools. So I don't know what I want to do most. I probably would do like the Oh, the stalagmite pickaxe. That's it. So that'll get me to some of those areas that I haven't been to. But I might just do the large copper rocks first. I don't know about the shovel. I'm not sure which that's going to get rid of. Uh, but I'd probably do the large copper rock one first or the stalagmite one. The other ones aren't as important. I'm not sure what the shovel would do though. But like I said, we need to find more mist because we did just use all our mist on borderlands. But we officially have everything unlocked. Um, every area unlocked, which is really awesome. We do still need to access up here. We haven't gone up here. And I think there might be some other places we haven't yet been to just because of some of the tools that we need. So we'll just have to explore as we go. But this is exciting. This was a really exciting episode with like Jafar and everything. Anyway, I'm going to end it here. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe and I will see you next time.